two things are very, very different. And we need to address them. First things first, I have braces, which means that I have an annoying lisp that is really embarrassing. So just bear with me for the next like week and a half while I get used to these in my mouth, all of this weird metal that's going on. And I promise you guys, I will start speaking normally very soon. Actually, if you guys have braces, let me know if the lisp goes away. Because I have no idea if it does or not. Second thing is I moved and I completely redecorated my bedroom for back to school season. So today I'm going to be doing a room tour, which I haven't done in a very, very long time. So I did a little detective work and I realized that I haven't done a room tour since I lived with my parents, which was not a long time ago, but I still definitely moved out of my parents' house for college, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are going to college and moving into a dorm or into an apartment nearby. So I thought that it would be very necessary to show you guys all of the changes that I've done with my room for back to school season. You guys should definitely go and check out my old room tours. I will link the playlist to my old room tours down below. So after this video, be sure to go and check out all of the room tours from like my past. It's kind of like a throwback Thursday type of thing, except it's not Thursday. So yeah, I'm just going to do a room tour for you guys. I filmed this one a little bit different, so hopefully you guys will like it. I think you guys will. And without further ado, let's get into the video. Please, I got you. Hey, yo, I once was a kid, all I had was a dream. Okay, so right now I am in my, I was about to say my bedroom, but this is a room tour. Now we are by my bed, and basically you guys can kind of see what's going on with my bed. I changed the entire thing around. Normally I kind of go with like a white type of theme with my bedroom. But this time I was like, I think I'm gonna go with like more color. So I got this really cool bedspread from Target and it was like $30, which is really cheap as compared to like Urban Outfitters ones or like Anthropology ones. But I think this one still looks really like bohemian and colorful and cool. And then on my bed, you guys can see, I have this really cool type of blanket McBobber that I got from dormify.com. So yeah, I get cold really easy. So I have to have a blanket wherever I go and that includes my bed. Then onto my pillows. I have three kind of like decor pillows on my bed. They're all from Dormify. And then I have two pillows that are just like with the duvet cover that I got. So that is it for my bed. Okay, so now on to my nightstand. This is like one of my favorite parts of my room just because it's like so colorful and it has a bunch of stuff on it that I love, like little tiny decorations. So this plant right here, I got this from Ikea. Well, I got these flowers and I love them. They're so pretty and colorful. Then on my bed for my birthday, Andrew got me this really epic like giraffe kind of like ring holder. I actually don't know if it's a ring holder, but I just, I love it so much. So I got it and I just put my favorite rings on it. It's a giraffe. Then I have my clock and this is just for show. It's like a Nicole Miller clock from TJ Maxx and it's super cute. Tells me what time it is. So yeah. And then last but not least, I have a notebook and a file because I like to write things down in the middle of the night when you get like ideas at like 12 o'clock at night when you're watching movies on your laptop. So you guys might remember this awesome thing. I just almost fell over. This awesome thing is my photo string from my Tumblr room decorations video and you guys should definitely check that out if you want to learn how to make your room look Tumblr. But I loved that DIY so much that it's traveled with me throughout all of my movements and whatnot and I put it in different spaces in my room. I just like switch it up really easily because you can just like undo it and move it wherever you'd like. So yeah, I have this awesome photo string. It is amazing and I would recommend anybody to make it because it cost me like $5. So I have that right here so I could wake up in the morning and look at it. And then I also just have one of my hats hanging on a little like push pin McBobber on my wall. So here I have my rugs. Oh. Tell mommy I'm sorry. This life is a party. Remember okay, so now we have my dresser area. And in my dresser, I just have like a ton of stuff all over my dresser to kind of like look pretty and help me get ready faster. So on my dresser, I just have this really awesome candle from Anthropology and I am kind of obsessed with Anthropology, especially their candles. So Bath and Body Works candles are 20, like $21 or whatever. 
and I always buy them but then they never really like fill the air with the smell of the candle but anthropology candles my entire freaking apartment smells like roses and daisies and daffodils and baby's butts and it's awesome then I just have one of my lenses I got a new lens recently which is awesome and then I have a mini jam box which is like the coolest jam box type of speaker thing I've ever seen this speaker sounds like a giant house party is going on in your bedroom it plays super loud and I definitely recommend anybody who's looking for like a speaker to try the jam box because it is like so amazing don't even buy like a speaker system just buy the mini jam box so then i have my jewelry collection and my perfume collection and i have been loving the victoria's secret bombshell perfume i have it in like two different perfumes and i have it in the mist and i just love it i just keep buying it because this is the only like perfume that i trust really i just know that this one works for me so i just keep buying it i have this really cool kind of like birds nesty white um, like paper collector type of thing and in here I put my homework I put anything that I need to get done like immediately so I just stick it in there right now my wallet is in there I don't know why I put it in there well okay then that's for like five dollars that I got from TJ Maxx for five I have this really cool owl decoration that I got from TJ Maxx for like five <laughs> decoration is from TJ Maxx and I got it for like five dollars which is awesome because I don't like spending tons of money on room decor which is why I frequent like Target, TJ Maxx, Ikea. This is my whiteboard that I DIY'd and you guys will see how I DIY'd it in my collab with Meg that I'm doing pretty soon you guys will see that like next week but I just have this board I keep a bunch of important stuff on there and I keep cute pictures I have this really cool picture from Tumblr that I printed out on it. So that's where I keep that stuff. You was a kid, days of the innocent. And then last but not least for my room tour, I have this little sitting area. I got this chair from TJ Maxx and then I got this awesome pillow for my birthday from Anthropology. And this is probably like one of the only expensive things I would ever buy for my room. But it was my birthday and I loved how like it has all these pom poms all over it. So I bought it. I could have probably made it myself, but I was way too lazy and I impulse buy. Then I have this little sheepskin rug from Ikea that I draped over my chair. And then last but not least, I have this pillow from TJ Maxx with beads all over it because I love beaded pillows and that is my chair. And right here I'll just like read books and magazines and edit and when people come over they can sit here instead of like everyone piling on my bed so it works out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this room tour and if you guys did be sure to give it a thumbs in the air, like in the a year, a year. What song is that? In the a year, a year. Oh yeah. Oh hot damn. This is my jam. Keep it partying until the a.m. Y'all don't understand. Make me throw your hands up in the air. Okay. Anyway, throw your thumbs up in the air and wave them like you just don't care. Be sure to go and follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter. And yeah, guys, I'm about to hit 100,000 on Twitter. So that's pretty epic. So yay, that would be awesome if you guys want to follow me. And be sure to go and click the link in the description to get to my old room tours. So that's it for this video. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys very soon. Bye. Bye. Yay.